orthographic projection too. In the blue section up here we have the elevation and in the pink section below we have the plan and the line here is called the XY line. Now when we're looking at the elevation the XY line becomes this line here becomes the ground or the horizontal plane. So the XY line represents the horizontal plane there. In the plan here now, when we're looking straight down on it, the XY line, the XY line here represents the vertical plane or a wall. It's a vertical surface, a vertical plane. The XY line will always be either the vertical surface or horizontal surface. Yesterday we drew this block here. This is the elevation in this position. The line between these two surfaces, in other words the line between the vertical and horizontal here is called the XY line. Now, when we're looking in this position, the XY line is the ground or the horizontal plane. When we're looking in plan here, the XY line is the wall or the vertical plane. I want to draw the plan of this block. The distance out from the vertical plane here is 20 and the width of the block is 45 and the length of it is 140. So mark the down 20 from the XY line and then 45 down and draw your two lines horizontally across the sheet. Now choose a starting point for the plan and then measure 140 across and draw two vertical lines. Again let them run the length of the sheet, the light lines. And that's your plan now. Now we line in the plan. So draw the two vertical lines in heavy and then the two horizontal lines. That's the plan complete. Now we have to draw the elevation. This is what the elevation will look like here. The height here is 25. So again, measure up your 25, draw your horizontal line and line it in. And that's the elevation and that's the plan. Write in elevation on your views and plan. And now this is what we have done. This is your piece. This is the piece from yesterday. Again, it's, that's the plan, that's the elevation. Now over here we have a yellow surface and we're going to draw the end view here. Just to turn it up towards you so that you can see the way it's going to be projected. That's the end of the piece that's facing us there. So these lines here continue out here to get us to the location of the end view. And the thickness of this is the same thickness as the front of it. 25. So measure out your 25 and draw your line and line it in and that there is the end view complete. Now this line here is the XY line as in the case of the elevation. Now, this is what, how we got it. We're looking directly down at the piece here. We see the end view. And that's the plan there. And then the elevation here. This plane here, the yellow plane, is this plane here. And our view of this is like this. 
Now this is the elevation that we had at the beginning on the plan and now there's the end view. This is the first XY line here and this is the second XY line. The height from the ground to the fascia board is the same in both cases here and the height from the XY line or ground to the top of the roof is the same in this case XY line to the top of the roof here. And that's your orthographic projection sheet two finished.